Hey there, it's Mr. Brown. So some of our assignments coming up, we're going to have to turn in our drawings. So we'll either be doing some design projects or some technical drawings. And you will have a drawing that could be on graph paper, could be on another sheet of paper. Um, so one of the ways that we can turn it in is by taking a picture with our laptop. So this is one of your laptops. I have to record it. I can't take a screenshot because I'm showing you the camera. And so let's say I have my drawing right here, and I want to take a picture of this and turn this in. So we can do it, one of the ways we can do it is with the camera app on your computer. So if you go to start and up to camera, you're going to see my phone recording this and me right here on my laptop camera. So what I can do is I can just hold this up to the screen, but there's a couple things that'll make that work just a little bit better. So let me move this out of the way here. So if I just hold this up to the screen like that, you can see on the screen there, it's a little bit blurry. It's not very flat. It might be a little bit hard to see because of the lighting. So a couple little tips to help you out here. One is if you just grab a book or a flat surface, just anything, hold your paper onto the book, that's going to help give you a nice flat picture right there. All right, so my paper just flat against my book, and you can see it looks a little bit better right there. Next thing I can do is I can hold this at an angle that I can actually see everything on my screen, or I can put my screen down a little bit, hold this right here. Come back until you can actually see everything. If I'm too close, you can see all the top and the bottom are cut off there. If I come back too far, that's just a lot of wasted space. So just get it good that you can see everything you want on there. Uh, if you want to get really fancy with it, hold it down flat so it's not moving, so I don't have to hold it or anything. And then when I'm ready to go on the computer, I'm going to hit that little camera button to take a picture. So I'm going to make sure everything's on my screen, make sure it's not too dark, not too light, and hit take photo. There. So now that photo is saved onto my computer somewhere. So let's go ahead and find that photo. All right, you're looking at my camera. Fantastic. All right, so this picture right here, if I click it, it is saved to my camera roll. So... One thing I can hit share, and that might be helpful, might not be, um, probably not. Let's hit see more, and I can hit save as, so that'll help me find out where it actually is on my computer. So let's hit save as. Let's put it somewhere where you know where it's going to be, so let's just say pictures. Give it a name, because win underscore 20200298 underscore that's not very helpful so give that a name of whatever it is so I'm gonna call it technical drawing one and then you'll see it's gonna save it as a JPEG image in my pictures folder so now I've got that right there I can go to Google I can go to like my Google drawings so this is Google drawings that we've used I can insert an image, and this is where you can go upload from your computer. I can go to my pictures folder, go to my technical drawing, hit open. And now I can use that crop tool to get rid of things I don't need right here. So let's crop. If you go too far, you can just bring it right back out. And get rid of some of that extra stuff if I don't need it and hit enter so now I've got a picture right here I can save that so remember always give your thing a name here so let's call it technical drawing one. Oh, I hit F1 one and then you can make a copy, you can download it as your PDF or JPEG or PNG image for whatever you're doing next. So if you're turning it in, you know, you could turn in a JPEG image right there. 